Aircraft in North Carolina was found safe overnight. Police are now investigating the mystery over her disappearance, and ABC's Steve Osasami is in Asheville, North Carolina, with the latest. Good morning, Steve. Good morning to you, George. It is quite the mystery, and it is fortunate that this child lived. Asheville police, who are investigating this directly behind me, are trying to figure out how in the world a baby got to a lawn some 20 miles away from where the mother says the child went missing. This morning, a seven-week-old baby girl whose mother says she was kidnapped is safe and sound after a homeowner just happened to hear the baby crying in his front yard in rural North Carolina. We just heard a baby crying. And uh, my wife said, Scott, there's a baby crying down our, over the driveway somewhere. And I went to looking, and I seen it down over the bank. The baby's mother told police a frightening story that she and the newborn, Shaley, were kidnapped by a man and woman wearing ski masks around 4.30 Thursday afternoon. But the mom says only she was able to escape. Two hours later, police found their missing car but did not find the baby. Then at 8 p.m., Scott Fowler heard the cries of an infant outside his home. He and his wife found the child in a car seat placed next to a rock in his yard. Anywhere else in these mountains, not, not ever been found. He's thankful the child was left close to his home. We expect police to share more details today to answer some of those questions. As far as the child's condition, Amy, they tell us that she is in good condition, was not hurt, and that, of course, is a blessing. Yeah, thank goodness Amy. for that. Steve, thanks so much. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our